Hey guys, Ben here, and uh, today I received a phone call on the landline, and it was a phone scam. And I just kind of started recording about two minutes in, ran out of phone space uh, a little bit further in, and had to start recording another way. Uh, so you have about a 40 minute video of an actual phone call, um, and I'm being a little bit ridiculous, but they actually, I think at one point, felt I was going to bring $399 or send it to them or wire it to them. Uh, one way so I could receive my 1.9 million dollars and Mercedes-Benz delivered by the RCMP. So there's a bunch of illegal stuff that they do um, and say and the whole thing's a scam anyway. But people do fall for this so don't fall for this if you get this type of phone call. Just hang up, tell them, take you off the, the call list which if they say no you know it's a scam anyway. So uh, if you got four minutes burn, watch it uh, and tell people to, to hang up. Recorded by the RCMP. There is no reason for us to lie or to try to defraud you here. All right. Okay, so you're you're not defrauding me in any way. No, sir. That will not be possible. All right. Okay, so I get one point nine million dollars, and you're throwing in a Mercedes Benz. That's correct, and you, you're just a second place winner as well, all what, right? what was first place? No, okay, the first place winner, they received $4.6 million with also a brand new Mercedes-Benz car because they have been sponsored as well, all right? That's very, $4.6 million? That is correct, and he received his delivery in Kitchener. And right now he's spending his success very successfully. All right. That is awesome. So when do I get when do I get my cash in my hand? Okay. As soon as we receive the authorization from the government department, your delivery should be delivered to you by today. All right. You're kidding. And will you be at your home today to receive your delivery, sir? Oh, I will be here. Alrighty, and also, how would you like this delivery to be scheduled? Would you like it to be public or private? Public means it will be over the TV station, the radio station, the internet, also the Gleaner paper. Private means it will be confidential. I say we make it a spectacle. I want everybody here. I want it to be, I'm, I'm inviting friends from all over the world. Alrighty, so you need it to be public, right? Oh, it's going to be huge. Alrighty, no problem. So it will be over the world, alright? I want it to be the greatest prize winning ever. Alrighty, no problem. And I'm going to have my mother bake a cake. Pardon? I'm going to have my mom bake a cake for this event. Are you are you no coming? Problem. That will be great. And what type of cake will your mom be baking? Well, I'm thinking chocolate with uh, some icing, um, vanilla icing. Uh, maybe throw some candles on there. Um, you know, something like that. What do you think? What's your favorite kind of cake? No, okay, I'm not a I'm not a cake type, but at You're, the same time, I'll eat a nice life. All right. You're not a cake guy? No, I'm not a big cake type, all right? Because I'm allergic to sweets, all right? You're actually allergic to sweets? That's correct, sir. That right? is rough. What about a pie? No, okay, no, no problem. Pie will be great, all right? Great. All righty, so we also have some government form here. Uh, also, also, I gotta say, it will be a gluten. It will be a gluten non-GMO organic pie. Pardon? It'll be a, a gluten-free, non-GMO, organic pie that will you you'll be able to have. No, okay. Yeah, you can so you can do the the one that is less sugar. All right. Yeah. Oh yeah, sugar-free, all the way. Oh yeah, yeah, the sugar-free one. All right. All the way, because you're 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 allergic allergic to sugar. That's correct, sir. All right. <sighs> tough. It's tough. Uh, all righty, and also we are here getting together the government farm. 
so we can have the authorization to make out your delivery today, all right? Okay, what do you need on the government form? All right, just asking you some questions so we can have it filled out, all right? Okay, and I'm just going to ask you, this is safe, right? You're not yeah, scamming me in any pardon? way, are you? Pardon? You're not scamming me in any way, are you? You would tell me sir, that, right? Listen, sir, listen, our call is being recorded, and there is no reason for us to try to scam you or try to defraud you, all right? Okay. You are not the only selected winner, and you won't be the last, or you won't be the first, all right? Okay. All right, sir. So it's only up to you if you need to receive your delivery successfully, like all the other winners, all right? Okay. All right. So these questions that is required... I'm going to speak of them right now, all right? Yes. All righty. Are you a Canadian citizen? I, I am. Do you married, single, divorced, or adult? I am, uh, well, uh, in between. There's, there's a bunch of things there. You're asking, that's a very complicated question. All righty. Do you own your own home? Um, that, again, that's a complicated question. I'm kind of a... A worldly traveler. Uh, some people call me a gypsy. Oh, all righty. And do you have a valid? Do you have a valid identification card? It all depends on what kind of government you are. Pardon? It all depends on what kind of government you are. No, okay. We're we're with the federal government. These are some federal government questions. All right. I know, but I'm I'm not gonna get deported, am I? Deported, and why why should you get deported? Well, we'll just talk about that later, I guess. We'll keep that on the down low. Okay. Do you have a valid identification card, sir? I do. I do. No idea. Do you own a transportation? I kind of have transportation. All right. Uh, you kind of have transportation? Yes, I have, uh, it's a uh, TCI 18 speed. Okay. It's fast. And how long do you have it? Oh, I've had that uh, since 2010. All right. And do you over or under the age of 65? I am under the age of 65. All right. And do you have a credit card and a debit card? I do. I do have a debit card and a credit card. And is this the first time selected as a winner for any cash prize or any award? I won a, a trip for two around the world uh, three weeks ago. It hasn't come in yet. And I also won... Uh, another cruise but that hasn't come in yet but I gave them my credit cards too and and, and I'm just waiting all right it'll it'll be coming though it'll be coming it will be came to successfully with 1.9 million dollar so yeah. it's a blessing for you all right oh absolutely all right and also can we bring over a photograph as well from the department Take a picture of you holding your check. Yes. Oh, absolutely. Absolutely. Um, should I get my hair done? No, okay, no problem because you will be on the picture, so you need to look presentable, all right? Okay, that means I'm going to have to get out of my underwear, put some clothes on? That's most definitely, <laughs> all right? Okay. All righty. And also, these are the few questions that was required to go on this form, all right? Yes. Yeah. All righty. And there are also some requirements from the delivery, from the delivery, the UPS delivery service. Okay. Are requiring that the delivery fee and the towing fee is required for you to dealt with. So what the company does, what we do, we take care of 99% of all the charges for you. And that's what 
That 99% bid is 48400 So we pay that to the UPS department so they can have your delivery complete to you successfully, all right? Wow, that is greatly appreciated. That's a big feat. No, okay, yes. And how how heavy is the check? Going out your vehicle and for the security as well to ensure that your delivery made out to you successful and secured, all right? Absolutely. This is awesome. But how big right. is the check? How large is the check, like, in weight? Because that that's quite the delivery fee UPS is nailing you with. Pardon? It's quite the delivery fee, that 48000 No, okay. Well, you remember, your car will be delivered also, right? And a tow truck, right? Right, 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 right. Yes. Okay, perfect. I'm, I'm excited. Are you excited uh, for me? Pardon? Are you excited for me, too? Sir, it's only for you to be joyful when we come over to have your delivery. Oh. I'm always excited for all the winners. All I right? That's a joy, all right? I hear it in the tone of your voice. Pure excitement. I love it. I love it. No, I mean, also, there is a requirement from the government department. Okay. That is a, yes, and that is for you to have your name licensed on your check, all right? Right. No, all right, and that requirement is only for $399 nice. to have your name licensed and registered on your check here. Okay. Will you, will you be able to take care of that charge so you can have your name licensed? You know it. It's only $399? No, all right, and when do you know where is the money grab located? Uh, hold on. What kind of ink are they using? To, what kind of ink are they using? Because that, that does sound like expensive ink on that already expensive check. No, okay. It's a government authorization certified cashier's check. Oh, cause, so it's kind of like one of those seals that you have to put on it. Yeah, it's going to yeah, be sealed, seal, all right? Yeah, so you know to make it those official. Officials, those official stamps that the government, they use. They are the ones that is going to ensure that your name is licensed on your check here, all right? Sweet! All right? All right, all right. that you are the one that dealt with your license off your check? So, yeah, let's do this. Alrighty, so will you be a, how far is the monogram away from you? Oh, it's it's probably about five minutes. I could be there in two shakes of a lamb's tail. Alrighty, so you will be about ten minutes from your home, five minutes away from your home, and 10 minutes, it's like 10 minutes for you to go to your money grab and back at home, right? Yeah, yeah, maybe maybe 30 because the XTI, it's missing the pedal. All righty, and do you know how to use the money grab there? Oh, yeah. All righty, so what I'll do, I'll give you the government banker name and uh, the, the address that you will be sending your one percentage to license your name on your check and to have your car insured in your name also, all right? Right, right. All right. So, are you ready for that information? Yeah, hook it up. All righty. The, the merchant banker name is David. David. Yeah, Sayer. That's S as in social. E as in elephant, Y as in yellow, L as in love, E as in ever, R as in run. All right? Okay. Yes, and it's Kitchener and Toriel. All right? What's the name of the bank? The bank is named what? It's Kitchener and Toriel. It's Kitchener and Toriel. That is where... Will you have the one percentage to activate your receipts 
through the money gram, all right? Okay. When do, Just when one second, one second. Money, when do you go through the money gram, you're going to activate a receipt with eight digit confirmation number, and those number is to license your check, all right? Mm-hmm. So how long it will take you to go down to the monogram and be back at home? Mm, 20. About 20 minutes from now? Are you answering this? Yeah. 20 uh, minutes from now? Yeah, 20, 30 minutes, yeah. No, righty, so mm -hmm. what should we do? What, what will you do? Will you bring your cell phone with you? Will I bring my cell phone? Yeah. No righty, so go ahead and provide a cell phone number so we can call you on the way, all right? Okay, can I call you? What's your number? No, okay, the toll-free number for the management department is 1876 832 all right? Okay, so I'll call that number once I got you the money? Pardon? So I'll call that number once I get you the money? No, you call that. You, we, we'll always be in touch, but you can call as soon as you have the one percentage take care of as well, and you have the license on your check. And we'll be over Avenue Delivery about 3.30 today to make out your delivery with the RCFC, all right? Okay, where, where am I meeting you? Okay, we'll, we'll meet you at your own. That is the reason why you need to have the receipt so we can have you registered. That is the registration. Yes, that is the register registration fee that you will be taking care of. So as soon as you register, we will be notified by your address and be at your own. All right. Okay. So I just wait for you. No, righty, yes, we'll be there with the UPS delivery service. Right now we have three RCMP circling in Antorio Kitchener right now, just trying to get the security for your delivery over to your residence, all right? Okay, so you're, you're right. actually in Kitchener right now? Yeah, the delivery already in Kitchener is only for you to have it registered so you can have the eight-digit confirmation number from the MoneyGram agency. And once you have that receipt, once you have that receipt, your name will be activated, your delivery will be authorized by the government to be made out to you, all right? Okay. So do you understand what is taking place for you at this time? Yeah, you're going to give me a pile of money. Is that... All right, do you understand what you, is required for you to do? Yeah, you need me to get you money. No, you're not listening, sir. You're not getting me a dollar. Your money will not benefit no one here at the department. Okay. Remember, we have spent 48000 already for you. You're only ensuring that your name is licensed by a government banker. Oh, okay. All right? That is what you're doing, dear sir. Right. So if you're thinking, sir, if you're thinking this is a joke, you need to let me know so we can have this re -raffle so another contestant can have the same opportunity. All right. Well, let me tell you, I wouldn't be on the phone with you this long if I thought this was a joke. And I tell you what, I could use the cash. Pardon? I could use the money, big time. No, okay, it's there for you. It's only for you to receive it. You're not the only winner. We have a third place winner in delivery who also dealt with tomorrow. So that is the main reason why we are here getting together your authorization to make it possible for you so we can have also the other delivery. All right? Let's make the first place winner got their money yet. Okay, did the first place winner already get their cash? Yeah, they are already <sighs> received their winnings. Okay, already. so we, we can't right. we can't get bumped up to the first place. 
Pardon? We can't get bumped up to first place. You can't give us because, you know, some people might think it's a scam. If that first place person did, could we get the first place prize? You, if you can get a first place prize? Yeah, can I get the first place prize? So are you playing games here? Well, I was just seeing if the first place didn't claim it, can I have it instead of second, and then the third place goes to second? The first place received their winnings yesterday. I told you that already. Oh, you're I right. You're right. That to you. I misunderstood. I'm sorry. I thought you said they didn't win or they didn't claim it, but they did claim it. So that means they claimed it rather than what I thought that they didn't claim it. So they claimed the prize. So, uh, that I didn't right. think they claimed. So what will you be doing right now? Will you go now to the money grant to have your receipt? That's what we're doing right now. Yeah. No, righty. Go ahead and have your receipt back at home. Reach back at home. Let us confirm your delivery so we can be on the way. All right? Okay, hold on. I got David Sealer, Kitchener. And Torio. Can you spell that? Pardon? Can you spell Kitchener Antonio? Antonio. That's where you are. You're oh, Ontario. Ontario. Right? Ontario. Okay. And do we give it to uh, a, a number? Is there a number? No. Once, once you go to the monogram, you're going to ask for a vendor's farm. Vendor once farm? Yes, once you get the sender's form, you're going to fill out the form with the information that you know on the form. You're going to give them the $399 with the form, and you're going to wait for a receipt. Once you get your receipt, you reach back to your home, wait for us to call you or you called us, you can call the same time. I gave you the management department number so you can call us, all right? Okay. All righty. So what you should do is to have this confirmed so we can have your delivery set for you, all right? Okay. All righty. So how long you will take to have this done? The next 30 minutes? Well, I hope to have it in 30. It could be 10. Um, like I said, the, one of the pedals are out on the XTI. Uh, kickstand's having a little trouble, but um, I, I will get over there. Alrighty. So what I'll do, I'll confirm it with the government banker and let they know what, that you will be able to have this complete for yourself and your delivery will be possible by the UPS, all right? Okay, now, like I said, I still have to pump the tires up in the XTI, um, but it's fast. When I get that moving, it's quick, but it's a little beat up. You know, the train's rusty. All righty, no problem. But remember, you also have a brand new car here, and that's the most important thing. Yeah, if you could, if you could get me the car, if you could get me the car first, this whole thing would be fast. No, okay, but I'm, because, like I said, uh, like the XTI with that rusty chain and the flat tires and the missing pedal, it's really tough for me to get around on it. Uh, like yeah. I, I'm only pedaling one side, you know. But well, the car is with the delivery. All right, the car is with the delivery. Okay. So once you have the once you have confirmed and complete that you have take care of your registration, yep. you will be receiving your delivery, all right? And your money will also be reimbursed. Okay, so, will be refund, so all right? you're going to deliver this right to Windsor, uh, right around the corner from London, right? That is correct. That's okay. your own. Because right? I'm, just, I'm just down the road from Florida, so if you can just get it into that area, we'll be good. No, righty. We will be there delivering at your home. Will that be the best thing for you to receive it at your home? Do they know my address? Yeah, like, um, and again, I'm like right between, um, kind of like right where Toronto is in Nashville. I'm just right in between there. All right, between Nashville and Toronto? Yeah, just like around the corner, like 10 minutes from uh, Calgary. Okay, all righty. So, so you know where that is, though, right? 
Pardon? You know where that is? They'll get it delivered there? Yeah, we know where Nashville is. Okay, and At it's the same time, once you have this confirmed, we'll be notified of, of the exact address where we should have your delivery, Okay, right? but you, nobody's going to turn me into the FBI, though, right? No, you're, you should not be worried. The RCMP will be there only for security. Okay, right? but, you know, I've had a run-in with the RCMP and the FBI, they may be looking for for me. And uh, why should they look in for you? Well, let's not get into that. It's kind of classified. No, okay, but they they will not just be looking for you because at the same time, your call is being recorded oh, here, it's being... and they will be there for security. Okay, should uh, I be wearing just just let me know? Should I be wearing my fake mustache or no? Like, what do I got to worry about here? No, you should not wear nothing fake there. Okay, but, All like, right? I just don't know why. Like, are the RCMP coming to take me away? They will not take you away. All okay. Right? They're only there for security. That's what you need to do. Okay, now, they're All not right? going to come in my house, are they? Because there's a couple things here that they probably would take me away for had they come in. So what should we do? Have your delivery to your bank? You know what? Maybe uh, have it delivered to me. Uh, I'll give you the coordinates out and there's an, a field um, by the airport. All right. No problem. You can have it delivered to you there at the airport as well. Okay. And you drive away with your car at the airport. All right? Well, like around the corner from the airport. Right? Yeah, no, no problem. It will be delivered to you. It will be set for you. Okay, so uh, they're they're going to deliver right to O'Hare? Pardon? They're going to deliver right to around the corner from O'Hare Airport? Okay, uh, as soon as we confirm it with the UPS delivery service, okay. we will let you know where they can make the delivery to you as possible, all right? Okay, because I'm just a little bit south of Myrtle Beach. All right, you're a, little, you're a little bit away south from Lake Beach? Yeah, from Myrtle Beach, yeah. So right. right below the, so it's kind of like right below the Toronto, Toronto Islands by the CN Tower. Also, you should go and get it this confirmed at the MoneyGram. Go ahead, get the receipt, come back home, call us so we can have it confirmed. And on you have your delivery set for you as soon as possible, all right? Okay, so I'm sending it to David Sealer. That is correct. Kitchener, Ontario. That is correct. And he's a government banker that is working with the MoneyGram also. And he's the one that will register you to receive your delivery with the confirmation receipt. You will be getting that. At the monogram you will be using, all right? Okay, okay. All righty, so go ahead now and have business done for yourself. Call you back in the next 20 minutes to have it confirmed. Okay. As soon as it's confirmed, your delivery should be delivered to you before 3 today. Okay, right? and what's your name? My name is Mark Westbury. Mark Westbury? Right? Mark Westbury. West Berry? Yeah, yeah, West Berry, yes, that's can, correct. Can you spell that? W E S T B E R R Y. Mark West Berry. Okay, what's your phone number, Mark? No, right, my phone number? Yeah. Alright, Ian, why, why my phone number will be interested with you, dear sir? Oh, so I can take you out for a non GMO organic. Um, you know, sugar-free pie one time. Can, no, sir, you can call the, the company toll-free number. Mark, Mark, need. Mark, we've we've this gone through this whole deal. It's just me and you now. I'm the financial manager here. You can ask for me, and you will be in touch, all right? Mark, I'd, I'd really, this is more personal for me. Like, you know, we've we've grown to have this sort of relationship with each other here. Um, and I, I just, you know, would feel more connected having your number. Uh, so, you know, just in case I get any questions when I'm doing the thing at the vendor, getting the vendor forms done, 
uh, I can give you a call directly and not have to talk to anybody else because, you know, this friendship has built over the last 19, 20 minutes. And I think that would be uh, just good for us. So what's your number? What you should do, call the toll-free number. Then you will be in touch, all right? Mark, you're, you're losing me, man. I thought we were friends. Well, at the same time, you should understand, sir. This is business, all right? Okay, Mark. Alrighty, so what you should do is go ahead and have business process for yourself so you can be able to receive your delivery. If, there, if there's any problem, you call the toll-free number that I gave you, all right? That number is a management department line for all the management, and if you call, you can get through with Mr. Westbury. If you don't, you can ask for me, all right? Okay. How many people work there? How You're giving out prizes all day? Okay, no. It, there are only three selected winners each and every month, all right? So okay. only three winners we dealt with every month. So we winner, winner, over, chicken dinner. We have over 58 different workers that is working at this this multi-international company here. Oh, All right. Mark, can you tell me one thing? Go ahead. Can you tell me I'm a winner, winner, chicken dinner? Pardon? Winner, winner, chicken dinner. Winner, winner, chicken dinner? <laughs> yeah, but yeah, a little bit louder so I feel it. What are you talking about, sir? It seems like you're playing around here. Well, anytime in my culture you win something, uh, you always yell out, or the person that gifts you the win has to yell out, "Winner, winner, chicken dinner." No, that is that is a that is a play game, sport. All right, and I don't play around. I don't play games. I don't run jokes. All well, right, Mark. I'm a I'm a down to earth person, sir. All right. So why should I go around and and and, and advertise in such things that you're you're suggesting? All I'm asking you to do is yell out winner, winner, chicken dinner, because I'm a winner, and I'm going to have some chicken dinner. Why should I yell out, why should I yell out that over the phone when there are so many people around there? Well, you uh, don't have to, you don't have to scream it, Mark. Mark, Mark, don't scream it. Don't interfere with anybody else that you're working with. Just like a, a winner, winner, chicken dinner. Sir, listen, what you should do right now is to be joyful in yourself, receiving your wedding. Okay. You are a multi-international winner, and that would be grateful for you to receive your wedding. Mark, right? Mark, if you oh. yell out, winner, winner, chicken dinner, I'm going to go fill out this vendor form for you. So I can collect my money and my Mercedes Benz. Listen, you're, not, you're not filled out any form for me. You're filling out this for yourself. I know, but Mark, you need to all right? again, I can't do it without you yelling out, chick, winner, winner, chicken dinner. Everybody knows that. I've Every, never heard of that. Everybody this side of Edmonton knows that, okay? Winner, winner, chicken dinner. Thank you. Thank you, Mark. Thank you. I needed that. Okay. Now we move on. We're going to fill out this vendor form. And you are going to, uh, it's going to be sent to the government, RCMP, correct? Yeah, it was sent to the government banker. He's the one that working with the monogram. Okay. We have the confirmation I have you activate for your winnings, all right? Okay, Mark, the one thing I'm, I have a problem with, I'm waiting for a flower delivery of some tulips. So do I wait to get that flower delivery, or do you think this will take long? Sir, what you should do, you should go ahead, go ahead, get your receipt, come back at your home. Okay. Your delivery is starting for you for $1.9 million. That I'm... is more important than some flowers that you will be getting. You can buy yourself a garden if you need a garden, all right? So you need to go ahead, get the receipt, get back home so you can receive your delivery, all right? But, Mark, would it be rude of me to not wait for the delivery person? I'm just asking, like, I don't know what to do here. I'm just so excited. 
Okay, sir. So that is the reason why you need to have this confirmed so we can have the authorization to have your delivery. All right? Without the authorization, without being on the phone for the rest of the day, it won't be complete for you. So you need to get business done for yourself so we can make out your delivery. All right? Mark, how long have we been on the phone? We've been on the phone for over 30 minutes now, right? Really? We could have just, uh, all you had to do is just give me the information and tell me to go deliver it. That's all we needed to do. Okay, now, so what you should do, go ahead and go get business done for yourself, all right? The problem now, Mark, is that we've wasted so much time on this phone call that i got to go to work. Pardon? We took so much time on this phone call, over 30 minutes, I'm going to be late for work. Sir, so what are you saying? You will not be able to get a receipt then, right? Oh, I'm getting a receipt. i got to just hurry up and get there before work. All right, go ahead now and go get the receipt and be, and be back at home because your delivery should be before 3 today. Yeah, because, right? like, it's 12.15 now. i got to be work at 5.00. And I just don't know if I'm going to be able to, get, with the XTI in the shape it's in, you know, get to the money thing and back to have my well, snack before going to work. You don't even need to work. You're $1.9 million richer. You can start your own business. That's the plan and that's the idea you need to have right now. All right? So you think I'll be to work on time or just don't go to work? I know you will be able to be on work on time, but you don't need to work. Because that's... $1.9 million richer. You're $1.9 million richer. And All say right? it with me, Mark. Winner, winner, chicken dinner. All righty. Go ahead now and get business complete. Bye for now. Hey, Mark. Will I be... How much pizza will I be able to buy? Pardon? Pizza. Do you like pizza? Sir, why should you buy pizza, dear sir? The, the delivery team is not hungry. And I eat before I go on delivery. So you don't need to buy any pizza. So you if don't you want the pie? For yourself. You can buy it for yourself. Okay, all right. So will this make me a Trump supporter or a Hillary Clinton supporter? Pardon? Well, it, Donald Trump won't take it away from me, will he? No, Donald Trump? Yeah. Why should Donald Trump take your money and you're not in the America? He's taking everybody's money to use it to build a wall. He's, he's not taking a dollar away from any. This is a licensed federal government authorization check. Okay. So, so there, is, there will be no one to stop your delivery or to take a dollar out of your money. All right? Oh, thank God. So go ahead now, get business complete for yourself. Have a blessed one. Be safe on the road, all right? Okay, and then you're going to meet me right, um, right close to Quebec there, right? That is correct, sir. So go ahead, get business done, so we can have the authorization to make your delivery, all okay. right? Okay, because I'm just like right near Montreal, right, right above Kentucky. Yes, I understand. So go ahead now so we can make your delivery. All okay, right? so nobody from Cincinnati is going to bother me? Pardon? Nobody from Cincinnati is going to bother me on this, right? That's probably. Why should they bother you? I don't know. I'm just I'm thinking if I show up with the XTI, which is a very, very, you know, you wouldn't believe how cool the XTI is, even without the pedal and the rusty chain. I don't want anybody taking that from me. Did I mention the FBI will be there? Are they going to be there too? Did I mention there will be any FBI? No, I don't think you did. Is there going to be? There was not. There will be three RCMP detectives. Okay. Right? So nobody's getting deported. Sir, listen. Stop speak like you're stubborn. All right? Go ahead. Get business done for yourself so we can make this possible for you, all right? 
Okay, so I'm going to make my bank account great again. No, okay, that is great. You're one point nine million dollar richer. So it's up to you to do what you need to do with your money, all and, right? And I only have to pay three hundred and ninety nine dollars to be one point yeah, nine million dollars richer. You registered and activate your delivery, all right? Now is the activation button is that like um is it a red button? Sir, I'm not sure about that process there. But what you need to do is to have you activate so your delivery can be made out to you. All right? Okay, so what gets activated? Pardon? This isn't like Rocket Man over there just activating stuff, is it? Like what happens um, when there's an activation? You have the confirmation of your delivery. That's the only thing you're activated is a confirmation of your delivery. Oh. Oh. So we go ahead now and get business done. I'll be blessed one. Be safe. Bye for now. Mark. 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 Yeah, come here. Will it be a Brinks truck that delivers the money? <laughs> Mark? I lost you, Mark. Tell me you're there, buddy. Don't leave me now. <laughs>